morning, YouTube. Or should I start saying good morning, guys? You know, YouTube is it's not personable. Personable? Is that even a word? I don't know if that's a word or not. I am here. I got unloaded last night at uh at walmart not a fan of walmart i'm telling you i am not a fan of walmart at mankato minnesota so let me tell you guys how my day went yesterday and i'm doing all this from memory so you gotta you gotta excuse me i was already bummed on the fact that i missed the day uh because i couldn't ride I only had three hours. I was getting back four later on that one particular night. So I decided to drive overnight with the nine hours or four. Uh, I know it was like nine hours. So I decided to, uh, to drive overnight to make it up here to Mankato yesterday morning. So I got to Mankato yesterday morning with an hour and four. 35 minutes left on my clock. Now that was pretty good, good timing. Unfortunately, when I got up there, the low <laughs> wasn't due until nine or yeah, nine o'clock last night. I'm tripping because I got there early in the morning that they, on a Saturday, mind you, it's, I, you wouldn't think that they would be that busy on a Saturday, right? So, I get there, guard calls. He tells me, hey, you know, your appointment ain't until nine o'clock tonight. And I was like, okay, well, you know, since I'm here early, is it possible that they can, that they can get me in? He was like, nah, we, we, we can't get you in. We can't do that. I said, you can't or you won't. See, there's a difference. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, he got smart a little bit and still just said can't. So I was like, good, no problem. All right, fine. Um, what time do I need to come back? Uh, well, you can come back at 8.30, 8.30 p.m. So of course you know what that means. I had to do a 8-2 split in order to get back, you know, get back with hours, which messes messed up my plan because the plan was to, <laughs> to drop or get unloaded there and then head over to Crescent Park, pick my load up over there and probably drive overnight to PA. Yes, I am on another load, a uh, long load, y'all. But the problem is I won't be able to get this load on to the on to the uh, check this week, which is no problem. No problem at all. You know, we got about another week to go before I go home, right? So I, I, was, I was held up once again by Walmart. <laughs> so last night I got there, I got there at about eight o'clock, right? Got signed in, got checked into the door at 2.15. After I get checked in, I take a nap. I'm thinking two hours, right? They didn't get me out of there until 1.30 in the morning. Four and a half hours. Unfreaking believable, man. You know, the, the shipper that I got it from, they, they loaded me within 45 minutes. 45 minutes. I thought it was going to be a two hour job up there because it was packed, but dude went in, did the damn thing, came back out 45 minutes. I was like, whoa. <laughs> so I, I really don't understand uh, Walmart sometimes. I mean, it, it really has your head to be scratching like, dude, really? I mean, come on. I mean, it ain't, it ain't like we don't have nothing else better to do. I had to go on here and, you know, put kicked off a of property because you have, you, you gotta leave after you get loaded. You can't, you can't stay there. You can't stay there. So the closest place 
that I came to was Walmart here in Mankato. Unfortunately for this parking lot right here, it was good and empty last night, but it would have been a problem for me this morning. So I decided to park over there, over at the Sam's Club on the other side of the building, which, which is adequate spacing over there. And no problems with this with this Walmart as well, because you know I looked it up and said truck parking is okay. It's funny that I am talking about Walmart and I'm here at Walmart about to go in there and shop. About to go in there and give them my little bit of money, y'all, after how they be treating us. <sighs> Damn shit. I got a poll question right quick that I'm about to go and poll some of these people here up at Walmart. A little bit different. Question of the day is, man, what if someone was willing to give you $100,000 to give up your smartphone and return to using a flip phone for a year? That's 365 days a year. In one year, $100,000. Well, somebody is willing to give you that. Vitamin water will pay you $100,000 if you give up your phone for a full year. So that's the question, y'all. That's the question. Could you guys give up your phone? Now, smartphones, all right? Not, not the uh, flip phones. They said it's okay to use the flip phone, but smartphones. So technically, you're giving up your social media. Can you do that for an entire year for a hundred thousand dollars i might say that i can i don't know but i mean i i'm not that big on on facebook twitter i'm big on instagram though maybe instagram might be a little bit problem but i think i can delegate myself to not doing that for a year for a hundred grand hell yeah i would try and do it at least i would try i'll give it a try let's see what these people think Bro, I got a quick question for you. What if someone was willing to give you $100,000 to give up your smartphone and return to using the flip phone for 300, for 365 days? Would you be willing to do that? Depends, I guess. <laughs> what if someone was willing to pay you $100,000 to give up your smartphone and return to using the flip phone for a year? Are you willing to do that? What if someone was willing to give you $100,000 to give up your smartphone and return to using the flip phone for a year? Are you willing to do that? I would. What if someone was willing to pay you a hundred grand to give up your smartphone and return to using the flip phone for a year? Oh, I can do that. Would you do that? You can do that. Mm -hmm. So you wouldn't miss none of the, none of the social media stuff. Yeah, <laughs> I know that's right. I'd be able to do that. <laughs> that <was great> <laughs> what if someone was willing to pay you a hundred grand to give up your smartphone and return using a flip phone for a year? Would you be able to do that? No. <laughs> <laughs> no. You don't want to give up your apps, huh? <laughs> what if someone was willing to pay you a hundred grand to give up your smartphone and return to using a flip phone for a year. Would you be able to do that? Yeah. Where is the health and beauty? Do you guys have that little mitt, that little scrub mitt? I think so. It's actually in cosmetics. So what if someone was willing to pay you $100,000 to give up your cell phone and return to using the flip phone for a year? Oh, you bet I would. <laughs> <laughs> I don't live on my phone. Right. What if someone was willing to pay you a hundred grand to give up your smartphone and return using a flip phone for a year? I don't know. I mean, I don't know that I would believe it's real. I mean, anything's possible, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Burgers. No, 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 no. Pork chops. Pork chops. Must be a truck driver. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> what didn't give it away? What if someone is willing to pay you a hundred grand to give up your smartphone and return using the flip phone for a year? Would you be able to do that? No. No, I couldn't. <laughs> 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 just, just because, well, it depends on how, if, you know, 
if you're talking like, depending on what kind of job you had, I guess, but if it was just strictly just to give it up for mm-hmm. 100 grand, mm-hmm. I'm not even really on social media the way it is. I don't even have Facebook. <laughs> So, <laughs> in that case, I guess, I mean, we'll still call. But, uh, All right. Thanks a lot, big man. Yeah, I appreciate no it. Yeah. So far, man, so far, these people saying, some of the people saying no, they, they can't do it, you know, probably for a number of reasons. I don't know, but some people say, yeah, for a hundred grand, they need the money. But what if someone was willing to pay you a hundred grand to give up your smartphone and return using the flip phone for a year? No. A hundred grand? Yeah, the hundred grand just to give up your smartphone. Just to go back to using the flip phone. Well, that's it. I am done here at Walmart. We're finished with the poll question of the day. About to head back into this truck. Yeah, it's made with bits of real panther. So you know it's good. It's quite pungent. Oh, yeah. Stings the nostrils in a good way. Brian, I'm going to be honest with you, that smells like pure gasoline. 60% of the time, it works every time. That doesn't make sense. It's like morning, but it's not early. But anyway, what's good, though? I am posted up here at the Loves in Gary, Indiana. Still on my way down to PA, you know what I'm saying? Woo! So you know, I'm on my way down to PA on another long haul load, which is very good by the way. If someone was willing to pay you a hundred grand to give up your smartphone and return using a, a regular cell phone, flip phone for a year. <laughs> I submit all my paperwork, smartphones, so make sure my pay is always on time, you know what I mean? When I trip plan my routes. What if someone was willing to pay you a hundred grand to give up your smartphone and return using the flip phone for a no, year? Thank you. <laughs> you wouldn't be able to do it? Nope, I got too much stuff on that thing. <laughs> I don't think so. But I'd be willing to go without Wi-Fi. Or in cell phone to live in a cabin for a million. If someone was willing to give you a hundred grand to give up your smartphone and return using the flip phone, would you be able to do that for a year? Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah give it up any day. I love my flip phone. The problem is it was outdated and they wouldn't let me have it, so I had to go put the upgrade the phone. If someone was willing to give you a hundred grand to give up your smartphone and return using the flip phone, would you be able to do it? Yep. <laughs> what if someone was willing to pay you a hundred grand to give up your smartphone and return using the flip phone? Yeah. <laughs> I don't need one of those. Come on now. It's only for a year. It's only for one year. Will you be able to do it? I don't know. It's too much technology that a trucker needs on his smartphone to not be without it for a year. In a quarter mile, use the right lane to take the I-80 East, I-94 East ramp to Detroit. What if someone was willing to pay you a hundred grand to give up your smartphone and return using the flip phone for a year? <laughs> I don't know, man, man, probably. Oh, hell yeah. You do? <laughs> With no hesitation. You say no hesitation. No hesitation. What if someone was willing to pay you a hundred grand to give up your smartphone and return using a flip phone for a year? For sure. <laughs> for sure. For sure. I don't know, man. Is that if it's a cab? <laughs> Will you be able to give up your smartphone for a year for a hundred grand? What if someone was willing to pay you a hundred grand to give up your smartphone and return using the flip phone for a year? I would do it. 
I don't use my phone that much. Then it didn't say on the news. It didn't say if you could use a laptop or not. Well, you can use you a laptop. They, you can use a laptop. You just can't use your smartphone. Oh, I'm fine with that. And I don't have a Twitter, so I can't sign up for it. What if someone was willing to pay you a hundred grand to give up your smartphone and go back using the flip phone? Hell yeah! In a minute, you ain't got to ask me. Just show me the money. <laughs> Will you be able to do it? I was just reading about that, man. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know, man. It's hard, man. It's hard? Especially for us. You know, we younger, younger generation, man. All it's right. Hard for us, man. You give up your cell phone for 100 grand for a year? No. But there it is. There it is, man. There it is. Almost done. I'm almost finished. Ready to roll out. And we about to get on up out of here, man. Love's right here in Gary, Indiana. You know what I'm saying? About to head down to... Bethlehem, PA. Yes, sir. I don't know where I'm going to next. I don't know. But I guess you guys will find out in the next video. Until then, thanks for hanging out with me. I really do appreciate it. What do you guys think? Vitamin Water is offering a hundred grand to give up your cell phone for a year. Can you do it? Can you do it? Honestly, can you do it? Now, Truck drivers, some of them says yes, a lot of them says no. Technology in the trucking is, is, is key now. We really needed to scan our paperwork, to receive our calls, to do our e-logs. I mean, it's gonna be hard for a truck driver to really give up their self, I mean, their, their smartphones <laughs> for a year. I, I really think you probably might have to jump out of the industry in order to in order to do it but it's a hundred grand though 100 grand pays a lot of bills a lot of bills yes it does all right well that's it guys thanks for watching i really do appreciate it if you like what i do and all these good videos that i bring to you consider subscribing don't forget to like and comment yo you got any questions for me or anything like that Hit a brother up in the comments or in his DM on Instagram at Lockout Men. You know what I'm saying? And don't forget the coffee. I really need coffee. But I got tea today, though. But I need coffee. So if you guys could hook me up with some coffee, the, the, the link is in the description and the comments below. Hook me up with some coffee. All right. Until then, y'all, y'all, you guys have a blessed one. I'll come back to you guys in another video. Peace. Baby, once I'm gone, I ain't coming back. You gon' have to settle with another man. But when you realize, don't be running back.